today we are going to show you how you could modify or edit contents of a CSP file using PowerShell. So let's use this file right here. So for example, um, we have this string in ver zero underscore zero one and we want to change it to something else like for example submeter o one okay so i know we could do this within excel like control h and type in what you want to find and replace with but for a given example like this wherein you have like 93,000 rows or even more it's going to be hard for your PC to fix it so what we're going to do now is we're going to use PowerShell to do that for us okay so let's close this one out so remember right here our raw says section underscore c in rear 01 underscore dot ac underscore power and we want to replace that string within that row that says in rear underscore 01 with something else okay let's close this one out and i'm going to open up my powershell So if you open up your PowerShell and see something like this and you don't see the um, script pane, let's just adjust this. Okay, much better. So I'm going to do, yes, I'm going to paste my script right here. So this would be similar to what we have on my previous video about modifying negative values so if you were to go check it out so what I did here is I use this uh, target folder which is the one right here and I declared it on the path to process okay so every csv file that you have within this folder powershell we're going to look at it and replace it okay so earlier we said we want to replace this word or this string right here with something else and chose it to be secondary underscore meter so i want to replace everything in this folder which are csv files that has inver01 on the first column with the word or the words secondary underscore meter okay let's run this okay so i got this message says processed he already PowerShell already processed my CSP file and let's try opening it up okay so you see now um, every row in column one that has inverter underscore o1 earlier has been replaced with secondary meter okay so you could do that even with multiple files now as we try to work with multiple files it's going to be of the same concept so you load all your csp files right here 
just make sure all of them are with the same format number of rows and we want to edit those strings inside column one okay let's clear this up let's try opening this one right here so you still see inverter underscore o1 on the first column and that goes the same with all other files here so same concept with that of a single file we we'll just load them in one folder and we declare what we want to replace it with right here this two declaration and the string that we want to replace whether it's a word or a series of number or a phrase everything just make sure that they are located on the first column like what we have in our example so we open up the second file right here it says still has inver 01 all over it this one out and the third still says in row one so let's give it a try okay I think we're done Let's do a single refresh and let's see. All right. So we now have secondary underscore meter replaced all in ver underscore 01. So it doesn't matter how many files you have or how long that CSV file might not be. The script will help you replace everything that you have or you need to be replaced with all right i'll leave a copy of this script right here on the description and give it a thumbs up if you like it share and subscribe thanks for watching